Oh, that's awesome. I was one of those. That's cool. But I got to say, what's the phrase that they always say? I don't, I've never played the game. Actually, I did play it once, but I only played as myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've only done one. Have you done more? I've only uh, done I mean, one. a couple. Uh, yeah. I'm Raspberry in Xenoverse. Uh, Sake Visual does a dating RPG game. I don't remember the name, but I play a character named Alvin in it. Alvin? I think his name is Alvin. I like it. Yeah, he's, that's, he's, a, he's, a, yeah, never mind. Uh, uh, I, uh, does anybody play Smite? I've heard of it. Okay, we got a few people. I said this earlier and I got a much better reaction. Oh. I play Hu Yi in Smite in two different skins. And, man, like, normally they just, like, bring you in to do the new skin. But, like, I got an addition side, like, emailed to me mm -hmm. for the next skin. I'm like, I got a re-audition for... Same character. That I want to touch that. <laughs> I guess she's talking about it. Anyways, private conversations. Yeah. Good night. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, what's your favorite meal? Oh, or you. So, uh, oh. I don't... Oh. 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 What was it? What'd you say? Hi? She asked me what my favorite Neil Gaiman book is. I can't think of... Neil Gaiman, he's a, he's a person that writes books. I can't, I can't answer that. I don't know. So, I'm sorry, I can't answer that. Yo. You, it's kind of a two-part question, but it's pretty much the same thing. Do you ever just like catch yourself like by yourself and just messing with your voice and have fun? Oh yeah. Just doing voices. And yes. Uh, yeah. What's the what's the second part? Well, that's it. Like, do you ever like when you're by yourself? Like, oh, now you want me to like <laughs> do that? Uh, no. Okay. She she asked uh, if I'm ever by myself if I make weird voices or play with my voice, and I do a lot, and it's probably really irritating to listen to. Uh, in fact, I do sometimes, like, when there's a song that irritates me that I'm listening on the radio, like, I'll imitate it in a really, really, really irritating way. And there was one time when I recorded myself doing it, because I was just like, I don't know what that sounds like, and it's just, like, awful to listen to. I don't really do it as much by myself as much as around other people. <laughs> around other... Well, okay, by myself, if by myself you mean with my cat, because my cat hears all my voices. Your cat is not a person. Okay. <laughs> that's a little bit. Uh, my cat, or maybe that's just the way that I talk to my cat in this one voice, like Greedy Poof, my little poofy lady. <laughs> I talk to my Greedy Poof that way, but then yeah, at work, at work, like when there's songs happening, and okay, so I also really do. You guys like uh, Miranda sings? Yeah. yeah. What is that? Hi, my name's Miranda. Yeah, I like to oh, do yeah. Miranda. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so she got there. I got to see her live in Dallas. She came. She did a live show. She's amazing, yeah. Um, so sometimes I talk like Miranda with um, other people at my office because I have a regular job as well besides voice acting. And um, I do stuff like that. And songs, yeah, songs make you do crazy. But, but when songs come out, I like to sing like Miranda, like, you know? <laughs> by me, now we got by me, you know I used to be my love. <laughs> like, she just, like, I like Miranda a lot, yeah. Yeah. Yes, my dear. What's your favorite movie based on a on Shakespeare play? Uh, I mean... Uh... Do you want to say something about you? No. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, 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 there's, uh, her. and she's, she's not talking about, like, a Kenneth Branagh, like, direct adaptation, she's talking, yeah, based on, yeah, right, I know exactly what my favorite one is, but I don't remember the name, and it's, Chicago? No, 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 Chicago no, is not no, one's, gonna, no one's gonna know it, it's, it's, a uh, Midsummer Night's Dream? It's like, Fergur. Which, where are they? Where are they in? Uh, are you saying Fargo? It's but with like on, a, no, no, no. 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 I'm trying not to cuss. Fergur. Uh, it's it's Mac. It's based on Mackers. Does anybody know what it, the Scottish play? It's based on the Scottish play. Mm -hmm. But it's called uh, Mick. Uh, no. Well, no, 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 no. no. Okay, ah, I can't remember the title. But it's about a fast food chain called McDuff's. And the manager gets murdered, like the, the owner gets murdered by the manager, mm -hmm. and then his like controlling wife tries to convince him to take over. Oh, it's so good. And Andy Dick is in it. He's one of the witches. Uh, it's called like Magnum. Uh, 
Hold on. So, just, no, that's not a word that's in Yeah, I feel like I need a list because the only Hang one on. I can think of is like West Side Story. Yeah, let's move to the next question. I'm going to answer it in a second. Yeah. Uh, and the purple hat back there. I got it. Macduff, uh, I think it's Macduff kills. No, it's not. Macduff's not in the name. So what she say? Mac. She said, what is your favorite super villain? Mm. Uh, um, I like Loki. Mm -hmm. Loki. I like Loki. Huh? I don't know. Very Loki, though. <laughs> Why do I feel like you're judging me? I'm always judging. I don't. I mean, I don't like villains, but. Um. Mojo Jojo. I, I'm not good with favorites in general. It's just I just say the first thing that comes to my mind. <laughs> and like I liked Moriarty. I like the BBC oh. Moriarty because it's just so wispy. I like it. I do like that one. Okay. That one's a good one. Who else? Yes. Macbeth is M A C, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it's Macbeth. On a stage, dude. <laughs> uh, uh, you're gonna break your freaking leg when you walk off. Wait, hold on. <laughs> well, I, what I have to do is a. Uh, I have to, you, you spin around, well you have to go outside, spin around three times, spit, and then say a Shakespeare line, and then I have to be invited back in. Okay. We invite you back in. No one invited back in. All the world's a stage, and all the men and women merely players. Can I come back inside? You may come back inside. Do you guys know about that myth? Do you know what happened? So if, if you don't, like, yeah, like there's bad luck in the theater if you say the name of the Scottish play out loud, ever. I've seen it happen. You don't even have to be doing that play for bad it's things even, to happen. You're, that's the only, you're only allowed to say it when you're doing it. Yeah, like, yeah. Wait, what? You, the Scottish you're only allowed to say his name when you're doing the play. Yeah. So that name that he said, that's why he had to go do that, to wipe away the bad juju. It's bad, it's like bad theater. Um, Yes, that's the end beliefs. <laughs> yes. Were there any incidents regarding that particular superstition about the name of that place? Many yeah, documented yeah. historically mm -hmm. on the internet. Google it. No, it's ha I've seen it happen. It's called Scotland PA. The movie's called Scotland PA. There we go. Um, I had a, a, like it happened before like an opening night of a show that I was doing and there was a uh, kind of lip on the stage kind of like this and one of the ladies like well it was partly that they didn't put enough glow tape down let's just uh, go ahead and say that and so she missed and like her entire thigh like slid down to the ground and she ended up with like this huge bruise and like got a hematoma and, and that's that word had been said earlier you say the what oh because of the movie Below it at you. Oh. I didn't catch all of that. I haven't heard of that. Oh, yeah. Many curses. <laughs> yes, you. My favorite type of weather? Weapon. Did you say leather or weapon? Weather? I just heard both. 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 Um, uh, <laughs> a samurai sword when it's cloudy. <laughs> I, 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 mm, she doesn't care. I care. I, <laughs> I have strong opinions about the weather. Oh. What, but seriously, what do you I mean, think I of like, the weather? I like fall a lot. Mostly because I like dressing. I like wearing boots and yeah. beanies and scarves. Where it's like cold but not snowing or raining. Yeah, no, but I like the rain too. I love Seattle. I do love rain. Uh, but I also love nice. a nice spring day. That's too hard of a question for me, man. But I, I do love like... Life is I do... I recently... Uh, do you guys go to Ren Fairs, Renaissance Fairs? Ever? Anyone? I like going to them and I decided that I really needed a knife. <laughs> I don't know how to use them or clean them or do anything with them, but I can wear it around my neck and it's this big. That's awesome. It's really tiny and it has like a 
turquoise handle. Can you really handle. remove it to stab someone quickly? Probably not. I mean, I don't even know if it would actually stab anyone. It's so oh, tiny. Oh, this is I mean, like, yeah, it's like this big. I could like open a letter with it or something. Okay. I mean, maybe I could like cut an eye out. You can stab a lot of things with a, a lot of people with a lot of things. Stab their eardrum. You should do that with your voice. Uh, dude with the camera. Yeah. What do you like place for pets on? Cats, dogs, or turtles? Uh, well, I've never. Can you a see my dress? <laughs> Cats. Meow. I'm a dog person. I like animals in general. Yeah, though. yeah. I like. I at one point I owned two dogs and two cats, and I like by myself, not like like it with my family. It was just me in a tiny apartment with two dogs and two cats. I just can't do dogs like with. Do you have a dog now? Well, kind of. I'm like technically homeless, and my dog lives at my friend's house, and I pay him money to take care of it. Okay. <laughs> like, it's hard to have a dog. I just think it's hard to have a dog. Me personally, because it like, it's traveling a lot. And my like, mom is always being like, "Ah, oh, it's a commitment." Yeah, it's. But like, like that dog was gonna die. He's living on. She's living on borrowed time. Like I could kill her at any moment. She's still like, God, she was better off. This got really dark. Gosh. You I love cool. animals. Okay. Um, uh, yes. Uh, specifically for you, Jade, um, uh -huh. what was it like voicing, uh, Elena in, uh, Eureka 7 AO? Has anyone seen Eureka 7 Ow? How do you say Ow. Ow. Well, okay, so, it's Eureka, but for whatever reason they say Eureka. I thought it was Eureka because of Eureka's Castle. <laughs> and there was another Eureka's trip over. Castle. Has anyone seen that? It's still on YouTube. The Halloween episode's on YouTube. You can go watch it now. There was a, there was I don't a, think I've seen that. There was another show that you were missing out. Magellan. Magellan. Is a character in the show. Um, voicing. It's a children's show. Okay, that's. Oh, okay, that's. Voicing Elena, Elena Peoples. Um, well, she also, you know, had an alter, an alter ego, which was uh, Miller, and uh, so it took a lot of energy. And it was really cool because she was like in an anime, but she was an anime fan as well. So I had to reference all of these, like do reference lines and like sort of impressions of all these different animes. So it was educational in that way, for sure. But then it was cool to do like a weird, like cool alter ego. That was a really fun show, yeah. yeah I don't know that a lot of people have seen that one. Especially that scene where um, uh, Ereka, like in a ghost form, like wants to, was looking for Al and Al and uh, she was asking uh, Elena where if she'd seen him and she gets all mad and like, yeah. Yeah. yeah, they they put that in the the preview or not the preview the trailer. Yeah, it's in the trailer right. where I scream it. Yeah. Yes. Uh, how like Ghost Hunt. Ghost Hunt. Um, that was my first major role ever in anime, and that was about eight years ago. It was, like, it was in Ghost Hunt. Um, I. Got to play a medium who was very whispery and judgy and clairvoyant and all of that sort of stuff. Um, uh, it was sort of a difficult show um, because it was my first and I was learning everything about how to do anime and how to match flaps and how to do reacts. And I was really slow at all of it because um, I didn't know what the heck I was doing. So it was a learning experience. I felt really nervous the whole entire time doing it because I just like wanted them to like want to hire me again and um, and I was like all the you know share me was in that and Todd Haberkorn was in that and all these people who really already kind of knew what they were doing were in it and um, so I was just listening to everything that they did if they had already recorded before me um, so it's it's pretty memorable um, and it's a really scary show too which was cool um, so I, I mean it was all of those things combined Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, Tyler Walker directed that, and he was, um, he's not always the most patient director, but, like, he, he was really, really great with me on that, and, like, took, but he, and by that, I mean, like, he'll just, if you no, do, I know, I know, I know exactly what he just, he'll just, he's so quick to give you a hard time if you screw anything up. He's like, oh, well, that was good. Let's, let's try that again, you know what I mean? Like, that kind of thing, so, but he was great with, like, kind of and teaching me how to do that. But he's amazing. Yeah, I mean, he's amazing. He's directed so many shows I've done, and like he directs really, really good shows like Fairy Tale. Yeah. You want to pick someone? You want me to? This is your panel. Oh, there you go. You, sir. We just moved into your panel. Oh yeah, territory. it's my panel time. Is there ever a role you've gotten, but you wanted another role in the same show? I don't. I don't operate that way. Do you operate that way? So, uh, say it again. 
He's saying, did you get cast, but you really wanted a different part? No, as soon as, no, yeah, no, as soon as we, you get a part, you own that. Well, and you're just like, I got a part. Yeah, yeah, that one too. I got a part in general. Yay! Um, you know, I don't like to operate that way because I just like to be super, super grateful for what I do have and what I do get. And, like, sometimes you're like, you've...